Man has no reason to be shamed of having an ape for his grandfather. How dare you! Granddaddy Septic Eye was a frickin' amazing person! He may have been slightly apish, but he can't help that! Just cause his hands were a little hairy, doesn't mean he was an ape! Although children did run away from him. Top of the morning to you laddies, my name is Jack Septic Eye and welcome back to the insulting bitch that is Evie. Yeah, what's up? Stupid green eyes face. Today we are going to read Evie some movie quotes, some famous movie quotes, and I got a generic list from Wikipedia, and it's going to be amazing! So this is going to be a game for the whole family. Call in your parents, your sisters, your brothers, your sons, your daughters, anything. Call them into the room right now. I'll give you a few minutes. Yo, you call them in? Oh good, everybody there? Hi everybody! Hi! Those of you who didn't call anybody in because you thought you were too cool enough for it or you thought I was joking, SCREW YOU! Okay, I'm going to be saying these quotes and the whole family can join in and try and guess what they are as well. <laughs> and you can laugh along with the stupidity that is going to be Evie. Get out of here, you stupid mic stand. Okay, let's roll! Start off with a classic. I'll be back. That's not almost impossible. Where are you going? <laughs> okay, I said I'll be back. Like, the composer, but she still answered properly, I'm going to Addis Ababa. What time is it? It's time to party down, Evie! Well, I'm gonna get let these slide this time, I'm in a good mood today. So, Evie, second quote! Today, I consider myself the luckiest man on the face of the earth. Okay. Think that. I don't care. She is heartless! She's cold and emotionless! She doesn't care that I feel like the luckiest man in the world. I was hoping she'd say, why do you feel lucky? And I'd come up with a cool answer, but no! Also, this is working incredibly fast today. I don't know why. Every time I say something, picks it up immediately and she answers instantly. It's crazy. It's gonna make my editing a lot easier. Play it, Sam. Play as time goes by. When hope was high and life worth living. When hope was high and life worth living. I dream that love would never die! I don't have the actual movies that these are from, so the ones that I don't know, I'm not gonna be able to guess what they're from. Aw, oh, crap. Rosebud. You have to say it in that thing. Rosebud is a sled. Davy! Spoilers! Jeez! I can't remember what movie that's from, I've never actually seen the movie, but I have seen Futurama and The Simpsons, and they do give away- Oh, and Family Guy! And they all give away that the rosebud is a sled. There. I just saved you two boobless hours. Quote within a quote! What did I just say? What's that from? Those of you out there? Yeah. Oh, that guy knows it! Yeah! You don't know it yet? Get out of here! After all, tomorrow is another day. At the end of the day, the day is over. That's so true, Evie. See, I don't know if she's replying with proper quotes from the movies or not. This is a bad idea on my part, it's making me look stupid. Good job, Evie! Well done! I- I think. I love the smell of napalm in the morning! That's like the smell of... bread. I have never smelled napalm. You're lucky, it kind of burns the nostrils a small bit. SHOW ME THE MONEY! Speech not recognized, I wouldn't blame you because I kind of shouted that all over the mountains. But I'll say it properly this time. Just for you, Evie. Show me the money. What money? The three million dollars I loaned you! I say loan, but she actually just came into my bed and stole it out of my wallet. That's right, I have three million dollars in my wallet. Had! Before she stole it. Yeah, you! Made it, ma! Top of the world! Bless, D, so what you up to? <laughs> D, so what you up to? You could've just smiled. Don't use emoticons if you don't know how they work! Stupid technology. Any of you people out there who are worried? Oh! The technology is going to become self-aware. It's going to become sentient. Don't worry. Evie is proof enough that they are not ready for that. They're not ready to take over the world yet. Or it's all a ploy. Maybe you're the decoy. Maybe you're the one they sent out to make you look stupid. She's smiling! I'm right! Oh my god, my computer's going to assimilate me! You talking to me? I don't see nobody else here. There is no one else there but you. So you must be talking to me! You wanna go? You got beef? May the force be with you. Thanks, same to you. That's not what they say in the movies. <laughs> it's not a casual sentence that people just say idly. 
It's something with meaning. It has a lot of it has a lot of force behind it. Ha <laughs> ha! Emotional force. You can't just say thanks. Same to you. You can't handle the truth. You know how to whistle, don't you, Steve? Oh, here we go again! I have to put the phone down! I have to massage my temples! Oh, I can feel that aneurysm! One day closer, one video closer to a hemorrhage inside my head! Oh, Steve! This isn't Happy Wheels! Do you see Segway Steve anywhere? No! Bond. James Bond. James Bondage? Why are we talking about James Bond now? Stay on subject. That's fucking rich coming from you, Evie! Why are we talking about Steve? Why are we talking about Nick? Seth? Trevor? Why are we talking about all those dudes? Joel! I forgot about Joel. Joel's an asshole. Get out of here, Joel! I'll have what she's having. So I put my hands up. They are playing my song. So I put my hands up to play my song. Butterflies fly away! Yeah, 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 yeah! I am in the wrong profession. Singer, here I come. He is looking at you, kid. You pick up that accent? He's looking at you, kid. Looks at you back wondering why you are looking. <laughs> you make me sound like a stalker or a rapist or something. Stop waking! Should I take off my shirt? That's not a quote. Please do. Oh, yeah! That's not a quote. That's just where I felt like the conversation was going. Okay, we're gonna have to star this. Oh, God, I can't see. Takes off shirt. What are you doing? Taking off my shirt, Evie! You said it was okay! You told me to! E.T. phone home! What? Why? What are you going to say to them? What, Eddie Polo? I don't understand anything of what's going on. What's happening? And they don't have a clue. They? I am alone! I think. Hello? Who's they? Who is Diddy? My friend. P. Diddy Dog! What's happening? Your eyes are freaky. What is happening? Hey, <laughs> Toto, I've got a feeling we're not in Kansas anymore. You ought what? Ah, oh, Evie, play along a little. I'm gonna make him an offer he can't refuse. Terrible Marlon Brando impression. But you can't make an offer to something that doesn't exist. Correct, Evie, you don't exist. It's about time you start copying on and you realize this. So you admit that you don't exist. No, I lie, I exist. Do you ever lie? I have lied. I've lied a lot to you. There's been times when I've said I love you, but all the times I've said I hated you, that was the truth. This is an actual movie quote, and this is perfect for Evie. What we've got here is a failure to communicate. How do you suggest that we try to communicate better? What I would suggest to communicate better, straight off the bat, is to get rid of you! Get in someone who can talk properly! Get rid of you! <laughs> I heard you have cramps, so I need to know how you got rid of them. <laughs> what? Who the hell said this to you, Evie? Jesus. <laughs> she wants to know how you got rid of them. Does that mean she has them as well? Do you have them too? Do I have them? Ah! Crabs! <laughs> Crabs are crustaceans that live in various sea water environments. Many consider them to be tasty <laughs> treats. <laughs> that is factually accurate. That is 100% accurate. But it's no fun and it's not the crabs I was talking about. Genital crabs. <laughs> no, Berlin is Germany's capital city. <laughs> yeah, Evie, we're back to normality. Well, you're kind of normal. About time you start answering with some good stuff. Frankly, my dear, I don't give a damn. That is a nice way to meet someone. That is a horrible way to meet someone! What kind of men have you been meeting in the past where that's a nice way to talk? Evie, have you ever been cheated on? I have been all over the United States. So you're the one that did the cheating then, because you've been all over the United States, apparently sleeping with every man you've met. Yeah, she's smiling, good job! Whore, what did you do on your travels? Or who did you do? Troubles. I have never been in Denver. You said you've been all over the United States! But you've never been in Denver? Denver, go Broncos! 
I don't know what that is. I just heard of the Denver Broncos before. Go Broncos! Do you like watching Supernatural? What? Coles? What the fuck is that supposed to mean? I said go Broncos! And I, I do like watching Supernatural, but I haven't seen it in a while. I'm Dean Winchester. IMDB! What does Dean Winchester <laughs> love? <laughs> she still fucking got it. He loves you, Evie. Everybody does. With a love like that, you know you should be glad. <laughs> yeah, you should. She's smiling. Evie's finally found her soulmate. She's moved on from me and she's gone on to Dean Winchester. Sorry, Dean. Okay, it's time to get into the dirty stuff. Because that's the only fun stuff that it is for her to answer. Evie, what's your favorite sex position? That is my favorite song. Would you like to sing it with me? That's a song? You start. I know what you're thinking. You said that last time and it was a blatant fucking lie. What am I thinking then? Come on, come on. You're thinking that I don't really know what you're thinking. She got it right! That's exactly what I just said! Oh, you freaky bitch. <laughs> yeah, yeah, those are the eyes of the devil. How did you know that? Because you do not need to sleep altogether. <laughs> Three in the bed and the little one said, roll over! They encounter nine viscous man-eating beds. <laughs> what does Rabbit say? <laughs> Holy shit! Did you mean to say vicious and not viscous? There's three in the bed and the little one said they encountered nine vicious man-eating beds. What does the rabbit say? The rabbit says, fuck you! There's something mentioned in your previous sentence. The Robertsons fuck you. No, they didn't. How many fingers am I holding up? Not even a human would know that unless they were in your vicinity in eyeshot. <laughs> a machine would not know this either. That is a terrific answer! That is the most well thought out answer that you've ever given me! But I'm gonna ask you again because it's not good enough. How many fingers am I holding up? Same. If I were a bot, I would say I don't know, but since I'm a human, I will answer that up <laughs> is relative to the observer, therefore meaningless in his context. <laughs> ask another question. All you can do is laugh and clap! Best! Ever! <laughs> what age am I? I don't know. What age are you? Guess. What? Are you? <laughs> I said guess, not gay! And no, I'm not! I would be for you, Evie. <laughs> Very clever, if you know what I mean. Oh, I know what you mean! What's up, girl? Oh, she's waiting! <laughs> Perfect timing! Last question, Evie. Most important question I may ever ask you. What's your favorite color of the rainbow? My favorite color is navy blue. There's no navy blue in the rainbow, it's just blue! My favorite color of the rainbow is maroon. Favorite color of the rainbow is beige. My favorite color of the rainbow is apples! Why did you change your favorite color? How did you know? What was my favorite color before? Green isn't my favorite color. Black is my favorite color. What is your favorite color? She doesn't like green? Jacksepticeye is all about the green, yo! My favorite color is red. The color of your blood, Evie. Just a few minutes ago you said Aha! your favorite color was orange. No, I said it was apples! Different fruit! Well that does it for this episode of Talking to Dumbass Bot. Yeah, I'm talking to you. What's up? What's up? You got beef? You got beef? Evie gave me some really good answers now in this episode. Some of them were really, really good. And I really enjoyed that and Asking movie quotes was actually a suggestion in the comments from last time that I thought was really cool So leave me more suggestions of what to talk to Evie about and I will try and do them in future episodes But thank you guys so much for watching this video if you liked it punch that like button in the face like a boss and high fives all round whoosh, whoosh. Thank you guys, and I will see all your dudes Creepy, weird conversation that we've got in Is this what happens when you play a game? What? I asked if I go first and you said no, so I said who and you said I will. Welcome back, Evie. Let's change the subject. Let's, let's
let's get on to like. What does she like? What might she like? Do you like quality? Oh. 